What's up guys? Thanks for tuning back in. Today we're going to be working on my tow rig. Kalen's actually been commuting this thing every week up to Reno and I'll be taking it up to Medford as well as Reno this summer. So uh, we got to do some maintenance. We got to make sure this thing is in tip top shape because uh, she's outputting a lot of work and we want her to last forever. So she did spring a leak at the water pump. Now I'm not sure if it's going to be the water pump itself or just the gasket. We're hoping for just the gaskets, but uh, I went ahead, I bought everything that we're going to need. I got belts, all the tools that I might need, uh, new hoses, new thermostat, water pump. Uh, I got just gaskets in case that we can get away with just replacing that. I've already got the intake boot out. I got to pull this fan shroud out. That will give us access to everything, hopefully, that we're going to need. Well, that really opens things up for us. That's nice. Yeah, this thing's definitely seen some better days. Ugh, getting hot. So evidently getting the uh, fan clutch off is a bitch. Uh, I saw something where they just wrapped some wire around it to hold it. I'm gonna give it a shot. I haven't even tried to take it off yet, but I mean, it spins freely, so I wouldn't be able to either way. Ooh. Shit, that fucking cable just broke. <laughs> Guess I'll need something a little sturdier. I'm gonna get this figured out. Well, I finally got it in the most janky, sketchiest way possible. So. I'm not going to show you guys that. Maybe, maybe when we put it back together. All right, so now that we got all this extra room, I can go ahead and try to get this camera in there. You can see it dripping right there. So that's actually right underneath where the water pump gasket sits. So I'm hoping that I can just throw new gaskets in it. Uh, probably new belt and new hoses and call it a day. It'll save me like 200 bucks and uh, At this point that 200 bucks go a long way. So uh, wish me luck I'm gonna get this water pump pulled off and we'll see what we got 12 seconds later All right, well now that we got the water pump off I did have a chance to inspect it and honestly I'm not gonna replace it normally I would um, but with my money situation, this water pump still seems fine. There's no any no kind of play. The weep hole's not crusted up or anything like that. Uh, there's no signs that this water pump's bad. However, the gaskets are missing a majority of it. Uh, there's supposed to be like a little rubber ring here. Uh, there was one on one side, but it was completely separated. It's got some pretty good nicks on it and I don't know what that was, but even looking at it, you can kind of see where uh, where it was leaking. And like I said, to save some money, I'm just gonna go ahead and replace just the gaskets. I'll go ahead and throw on new hoses and a new belt as well. I really don't want to compromise driving at Bash or Hot August Nights, so I think this water pump would be good. At least get me through the summer. Um, and honestly, it really wasn't that hard to replace. It's just uh, the hardest part was getting that, that fucking uh, fan clutch off. So all in all, that's the game plan. I'm going to clean up these mounting surfaces and throw this thing back together. All right, real quick before I throw these in, just want to show you guys uh, new ones compared to these old ones. We're getting it back together. I got the upper hose on, lower hoses on, the heater hoses are back on. Uh, I just pulled off that AC belt. That thing was fucking turped. So I'm waiting for Michael to get here so that I can run down to O'Reilly's using his truck because I have to put the AC belt on before I can put the main belt on and then the main belt has to go on before anything else can go on. But pretty much all we got now is just those belts. Um, 
the fan clutch and the heater shroud or fan shroud um, and then we should be good to go just get this thing all f all filled up and let it burp herself and hopefully it'll be solid see what i'm talking about straight chunks missing out of this thing all right guys well michael just showed up he's gonna be working on his shit but uh i can finally go get a belt for the alternator but i got everything else put back together uh, i started putting coolant in it so it pretty much just needs belts and the intake put back on and I'm going to start it up. So I'm going to go to O'Reilly's. We'll see you in a bit. All right, so I got my belt and now I just got to throw all this stuff back together and I'm done. All right, well, I guess I've got some updating to do. Um, so... You know, I was going to throw this AC belt on and this motherfucker was still leaking. So I pulled the skid plate off the, well, the, would you call it a skid plate? No. I pulled the plastic skid plate looking thing off the bottom. Well, it, it is a skid plate, but it's it, plastic. It probably protects like the belts from rocks. That's probably yeah. the most it's going to do. But the stupidest part of it is yeah. it's held on by 15s. Five 15. Five of these motherfuckers. No. no. We'll just go with that. It looks like this. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I, I crawled underneath, looked up, and it was leaking from the exact same spot. But I could see that it was actually running down. Um, and I know, I know I should have done this in the first place. I told myself that three or four times. But... Good old lazy fucking Aaron, just, he knew he knew what was best. So we had to do this again. We had to pull uh, pull everything back out and I had to go back to O'Reilly's, get my water pump back and spend money that it shouldn't have spent. Although I'd already spent it and then I returned it and then I had to spend it again. So. Shit that always happens with us. I, uh, whatever, I mean, lesson learned. This isn't a hard job except for getting that fan, that fan clutch off again. This time, somehow I managed to fucking Hulk tight it, kind of, and Michael was over here helping me. We had it all ghettoed up like I did the first time and it wasn't working, and then Michael put like fucking, we, we need a name for that guy because he's fucking like our go-to yeah. right now, like for just about anything. Everything. <laughs> Um, so, hey, hey, first of all, comment down below. What, what do we name the red guy? We already lost Thor somewhere. Thor's gone, yeah, but, but uh, we need a name for, for that. Comments, please. We need a name. What I'm going to do is I'm going to throw that AC belt on now because it was a lot easier to do with all this shit out of the way. And then we'll throw the water pump back in and repeat this entire fucking process. All right. Well... She's back together. Got to put this hose on, and we got to put the intake on. I put some more coolant in it, and then and I, and I did an oil change. You guys missed the oil change. Sorry. Well, I certainly had absolutely no intention of this whole video being us working on the Tahoe. I actually had plans to do shit on the 240 and stuff, but I guess that's what I get for. Uh, Trying to be a cheapskate, I guess. We're just bleeding the system. Doesn't look like we got any more leaks. Um, gotta throw this fake ass skid plate back on. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna head out. Probably clean up my mess, cause it's a disaster. We'll be back tomorrow, cause uh, I'm done with school and why not? Michael needs some help. I've still got stuff to do on the car. So we out here. Thanks for tuning in guys. Uh, I do see all of your comments down below asking about uh, wiring and other questions about this swap. Hopefully in the next week or so, Michael and I will sit down. We'll just do like a real quick Q&A. Yeah. Uh, maybe we'll post up on our Instagram. If you're not following us on Instagram, check it right there. We'll get some questions, we'll get them answered. Yeah, so look for that on our Instagram. It'll probably be, I don't know. We'll give you guys like two days notice. 48 hours. Thanks for tuning in. Sorry we didn't touch the 240, but it'll be back tomorrow.
What's up, YouTube? All right. All right, guys. All right. All right. All right.